Well, I love coming to Royal Sydney. I think it's it's uh, my favourite course up here, and um, you've done well here before, and and um, you know it just seems to to fit a little bit. Fits my game. Um, how far I hit the golf ball, at least. Um, and uh, you know I just like the feel of the place, so it's um, it's good. No, it's a brand new set of uh, Titleist AP2s, and um, you know I've been using some Callaways this this year and using some old clubs throughout the year and messing around trying to get the feeling right. Um, you know, it's, it's been such a change in equipment over the last, um, you know, five, five years, five, ten years. The golf ball's harder and, it's, uh, you know, my old equipment doesn't work with the new golf ball. So, you know, I've, I've found a set of golf clubs now that makes it feel good. And, um, you know, I'm getting the feedback through through the golf shot that I want to do, which, which builds confidence, you know, which is what all of us golfers are trying to do, you know, you know, use equipment that's, that helps you play as well as you possibly can. And, um, you know, I feel like I'm getting there. It's, good. it's going to be stiff competition for anyone, I think, in, in you know, Rory McIlroy being world number one and everybody knows the sort of the golf that he can play and he's up there. And Adam is obviously in just incredible form and, and chasing that world number one spot. And, you know, I think he'll do it eventually. Um, it's going to be very difficult and I'm certainly going to have to play the golf of my life to try and keep up with them. Adam's uh, filling Greg Norman's shoes. Um, he's on his way to doing that, you know, like I thoroughly think that the, the, the crowds that surround him and the popularity that surrounds him and, and with the golf here this season is, um, is, is like it was when Greg Norman was playing with us.